Good morning. Getting dog hair out of my coffee already. Trying something new. I'm in my pajamas. The weather's good. I said, yeah, we waking up, ain't we? You said, oh, oh. Uh, figured, try something new. Do a coffee crackers outside in the morning. Haven't done that in forever. Uh, guys, right now, if my watch is correct, it's about 6.30ish. And I woke up at 6, kind of get going. Went and put gas in the generator. I didn't turn it on last night because uh, the weather's a lot better. Uh, so I didn't run it and I just left the uh, door open, the screen door. And so uh, I did that or whatever. But I went and got that going, got coffee going, and just hanging out with Sawyer here. Uh, they all slept inside. Rufio just went back in. He's right here. I'll probably show y'all in a little bit. But man, it's eating. And then, uh, of course, Danielle is in town, so uh, Barley and Lucy are there. But he just is odd, dude. Uh, Bandit, don't go in front of the camera now. Not clean it. There you go. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, hey, Bandit, this, this is why it's hard to do like this. Lesson learned. Uh, but... Oh, I've been working uh, on trying to get the fence done. Had a lot of issues with my chainsaw to cut down stuff uh, to clear land. Uh, had pretty much the whole weekend of nothing but problems. And uh, just is what it is, I guess. There's really nothing I could do about it. So uh, I just kept trying to push forward and try to get uh, the chainsaw to work and uh my mind to work correctly it felt like yesterday my mind was just in a weird my body was going at a hundred percent but my my brain was moving at like 50 percent and my body would be in motion and as i'm doing stuff i'd be thinking like what am i doing and uh that's not normal normally my brain is the one going 100 percent or even 120 percent always moving never stopping and my body can't keep up. Uh, but here goes Bandit from the other side. Watch out, Bandito. Hey, you, that's not the best place to see it. Can you sit over here? There you go. There you go. Well, see it. There you go. You're not in trouble. You, you go. Uh, but, um, yeah, my brain, uh, it was just hard to get going this whole weekend. It was, uh, very much off so whenever it got darker and hey sawyer does not like people or uh, the other dogs in his personal space um but uh i spent the uh evenings playing guitar and stuff and that really helped kind of mellow me out uh so as you guys saw in the crocker the crocker live all right bandit bandit get in man go inside there you go she knows that. Um, I, uh, or we, uh, started cleaning out the, uh, shed the house over there and, uh, trying to get it a place that we could hang out and, and, uh, you know, get creative and have fun and, and all of that. And, and when you have brains like Danielle and I do, uh, that's something that is much needed, uh, I mean, every day I, tr I try to fight the idea that I have, like, ADD or ADHD. I guess I don't have hyper. I don't know. I don't know the difference. But I always try to fight the fact that it's like, ah, I don't have it. It's just an excuse, you know. I just need to focus and do whatever. Uh, this weekend has proved to me, and, you know, as you guys know, it's hard for us to, like, start a, a project, finish a project. We have to work on three projects at a time. Um, it's difficult. It's it's truly difficult to uh, to function and get things done. And uh, every day I try to fight it and, it, and it makes me upset. And I try to not let it upset me that I can't, you know, do these things. But it's just the reality of it. And uh, I'm I'm the type that I don't want to take you know, medication or anything like that, uh, to try to, I guess, fix the problem because I feel like I would then depend on it 
to be able to do stuff and I don't want that. I want to be able to always constantly try to work on my own brain, but the reality is I don't think uh, I would be where I'm at in life if it wasn't for being that way because with my brain always moving and always thinking of new things, it made me a dreamer. It made me the type to dream big and to think differently and it put me where I'm at and it worked on YouTube. You know, the Crockers is doing fairly well and uh, I just don't think it would be that way if uh, my brain didn't work this way because the things that I've come up with or whatever on the channel, you know, has helped me. And then, you know, whenever Danielle and I started uh dating and talking and stuff uh the channel's more than doubled since then you get two add brains and then it just goes off it's it's awesome because we get to really come up with some ideas and think and bounce stuff off each other and this and that it's just we don't have a third party to round us up and be like all right well let's work on this okay you need to remember to do this yeah um so that's kind of where we're at, and I started making lists. I've always made lists in my phone, but then I forget that I have it in my phone. So I need to try to make a list that's right next to the door or right next to the coffee maker, which is technically next to the door. So the first thing I see in the morning when I make my coffee is, boom, this is what we need to do today. And I guess, because I've thought about it, I just never have, I guess I need to start setting alarms throughout the day maybe every hour every two hours or something uh that way when it goes off i just know okay what am i doing it's just a a, a snapback i guess of what are you supposed to be working on uh what do you what do you what do you think about now what are you supposed to be doing and uh i don't know it, it's just very difficult and is 100 percent got the best of me uh but uh i definitely know that um you know, I've done what I've done, you know, in my life being this way, and I can figure it out. It's just this weekend was a huge test of that, of, you know, trying to get my mind right, trying to stay focused, trying to dial in the things that need to get done. Uh, again, it just felt like my, like my body was working at 100%. My, my brain was like 50%, and that was such a weird thing. Um, I don't know. I just figured, try something different, open up about this, sit outside, it's great weather, Sawyer's excited, you excited? Yeah. I'll show y'all guys Rufio, he's all dirty, but, uh, let's see. Rufio, what are you doing? He just sitting all proper in his bed. Yeah. Uh, but, I guess that'll be good for today, it's just a way for me to, uh, kind of open up and y'all can see how it's kind of truly like in this head of mine uh danielle just went to work they moved her to days last minute uh this week so she's there right now and i text her six o'clock this morning i said today let's make today our i said all right maybe let's just try to get something done with a smile on her face because <laughs> uh the weekend just beat me up and uh she had a great day though um from what she said uh, on days it goes a lot better so hopefully she'll have a good day today hopefully i'll have a good day with why are they all sitting all proper there you go the, we, we punk rock kids around here all right guys hopefully y'all have a good day hopefully y'all uh enjoy everything going on in those lives uh hopefully we'll get some videos out for you guys and get some stuff done but for now i'm gonna drink my coffee with with the dogs and uh go on with our day so all right guys uh, appreciate y'all, uh, absolutely appreciate y'all's support, and, uh, if it wasn't for y'all's support, I couldn't sit here in the morning and drink coffee with my dude, so, much love. Alright, bye!